Prerna Agarwal, Technical Product Owner for The Guardian. Today, I would like to give a quick demo on how to configure the Hedera local node. So in order to configure the local node, the first thing what you need to configure and set up is a local node in your local instance. So in order to set up the local node, you need to follow this link which I provided in the documentation, which will help you in setting up the local node in your local instance or a cloud instance. Once you complete the setup of your local node, you need to go to our documentation, which is docs.hedra.com slash guardian slash getting started, where you have a section where we have added a configuration local node section. So by which you need to update some of the parameters in .env file if you are building Guardian from manually, or you need to update .env.docker file if you are using Docker for building Guardian. So you need to update operator ID to 0.0.2 and operator key to the given operator key. So these two operator ID and operator key is the default ones which we use, which are given in the local node configuration. And the third parameter is local node underscore address. This local node underscore address is your instance address where you have set up the local node. So here we have just given an example. This is a, just a dummy local node address. This could be an IP address or a domain name. The fourth parameter is local node underscore protocol. This could be an HTTP or HTTPS. The fifth parameter is header underscore net. By default, header underscore net value would be testnet. But in order to configure local node, you need to change the testnet to the local node. And this, the last important point is if you are configuring local node, you need to remove initialization underscore topic underscore ID as the topic will be created automatically when you configure local node. So in order to get more information on the configuration links, please visit to our documentation. We have also updated our readme file. So please visit our readme file and you will get all the information regarding the local node configuration in, in our GitHub repo. Thank you.